can to support his longtime friend and on-field rival Peyton Manning, who received his gold jacket. But Brady's show of sportsmanship and camaraderie did not spare him from getting booed, and Peyton couldn't resist poking fun, of course, joking that Brady wouldn't be eligible for the Hall of Fame until the year 2035. So, Shannon, what did all of this tell you? I'm like, I'm like Brady, what did I do wrong? Everybody now, everybody give uh, Tom Brady the, uh, the uh, Commissioner Goodell treatment. I know. Just the mention of his name, they start booing. Skip, no matter. We were like, whatever you say, they should have suspended the play game. We're so far removed, move, removed from that, and we're so far removed from Zeke being suspended. But for whatever reason, mm. Commission goes anywhere, they start booing. Tom mm. Brady goes anywhere. Skip, I was at the, uh, when they had the 100th anniversary. Yep. And then, boy, I'm like, well, damn, this is supposed to be a compilation. These are the 100 greatest players that's ever played. Nobody should get booed. The one in San Francisco, right? Yeah. yeah. I'm yeah. like, how y'all booing? Yeah. What y'all booing? First of all, what you booing for? Mm. So I, 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 didn't, I, I didn't get that, Skip. But look, Brady had to be there. Skip, we might, we'll, we'll, I don't know if we'll ever see this again. Two guys, normally, if you're coming in the same draft class, you're linked together. Like uh, uh, Peyton Manning and, 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 and uh, what's the guy that went second, Skip? With the San Diego. Oh, Ryan Lee. Ryan Lee. Yeah. Skip, we, we get that. <laughs> Marino and Elway, because they were the same draft class. Jim, Jim Kelly, they're the mm -hmm. same draft class. Yep. But we've never seen anything like this, mm -hmm. Skip. Two quarterbacks, different teams that's linked, that's joined, is Bird Magic. That's what it is, Skip. Can you imagine Bird not being there for Magic, Magic not being there for Bird? Even though they retired apart, Magic tried to commit, tried to petition so they could go in together, and Commissioner Stern said, no, nah, you got to wait your five years. We'll let them go in together. But I think I, I, I can't imagine Tom not being there because it's only fitting, Skip, the, the way they play because, and they played, used to play twice a year because they were in the same division before they reconfigured the league. Yep. And so, and then, Skip, what made, what made Bird Magic? It wasn't the regular season. It was the playoffs. They were playing for the ultimate prize. These guys, five times they met in the playoffs, playing, trying to keep mm -hmm. the other from getting the ultimate prize. They played five times. Manning won the last three AFC Championship game. Brady got up to the great start. Brady has 11-6 and six record against him over the 17 games. But, Skip, they, 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 they're linked. I, I've never seen anything like that. I, I don't know two other players that are linked like these two players are linked. You can't think of one without thinking of the other. And because of that, because of the great admiration and love that they have for one another, the, Peyton is always trying to outthink Belichick. Brady was trying to beat Peyton because he knows that's the standard of which quarterbacks are measured by. Mm. And if I want to be what I believe that I am, I'm going to need to beat that guy. Mm. And so for me, Skip, I thought it was very – I'm not shocked at all. As a matter of fact, I would have been more shocked had Tom Brady not shown up mm. for, for this great really? – Yes, mm. yes, I, 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 I would I, I would have been shocked, Skip. And, you know, Brady, you know, Peyton going to get a couple of jokes in saying 20, 35 <laughs> in his first year when he's eligible, mm -hmm. you know, but he'll release it on wait, IG. Wait, wait, that means that Tom will play until the year 2030 yeah. when he would be 53 <laughs> years of age. That, that would be your worst nightmare, yeah, right? Yeah. So, so for me, Skip, I, I'm not, I'm not mm. surprised. And then Eli, Eli got it on the action, Skip. He did. Eli said, Tommy, I'm going to say you'll see for mine too. Mm -hmm. So it, it was great, Skip, but I'm not surprised that Tom Brady showed up. Mm -hmm. I'm just surprised that why can't why y'all booing? It's not like y'all had a chance to get Tom when he was a free agent, or there's just some kind of ride between Cleveland and New England, or Cleveland and Tampa. I, okay. I, I don't get that, but I'm not surprised <laughs> that 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 Tom sh sh okay. showed up for Brady. Uh, As usual, I see this completely upside down from you. Yet you are the Hall of Famer sitting at this desk right mm -hmm. now, so you have been to many of these ceremonies <laughs> have, and you know what it is about. Yes. My problem is this. I don't see Tom Brady and Peyton as equal rivals like I saw Magic Bird, Bird Magic, that they went back and forth and mm -hmm. back and forth. Obviously, Tom is now seven Super Bowls to Peyton's two Super Bowls. Right. And yet the, the glaring irony here is that what, what had to eat at Peyton a little bit on, what was it, last night, on Sunday mm -hmm. night, I, was thinking, I get the two ceremonies confused right. Saturday and Sunday since there were two of, two them. of them. 
But what had to eat at Peyton a little bit last night, he's only a year and five months older than the guy sitting in the crowd who's still playing for a team that right. many people think is going to win another Super Bowl, mm -hmm. right? Right. So Peyton has to say, God, how does he how does he get so lucky? He's still going. Well, I mean, luck, luck has to do something with it. God blessed him. With I the got it. Because I believe Peyton, had Peyton not had that neck injury, Skip, oh. I believe Peyton would have pro probably played two or three more okay. years. All right, before I launch on what I'm going to say about Tom Brady, I want to emphasize to everybody watching that nobody has defended Brady more than I have. Mm -hmm. I think you would agree yeah. with that. And I am his biggest fan and supporter. Right. But I was surprised that he went. Obviously, there is huge respect back and forth right. between those two. But I do think you could have made a case for Tom Brady staying at Tampa training camp and letting Peyton have his moment unto himself without trying to share any portion of that stage with him. It's a fine line between I'm here to support you or I'm here to take away some of your shine because I'm still Tom Brady and I'm the defending Super Bowl yeah. champ, right? Mm -hmm. And Tom delighted in being there because I believe that Tom is finally in the mode of, I'm going to enjoy this. Yes. I'm, I'm going to celebrate the spoils of victory in ways that I never was able to under Coach Belichick right. in New England. Right. And you have made that and case. And that might be the only reason he was there. <laughs> okay. Well, okay. Am I right about that? Right. Tom wants to... To, to just bask in the glory of it because <laughs> what current player belongs in the Hall of Fame more than Thomas Edward Patrick Brady right. Jr., right? He does, and right. he knows it. So I think he wanted to experience just a little taste of what that night is like right. because you know you, you've gone to many of these mm -hmm. nights, so you know and you've stood at that podium and accepted that award. Yeah. So you know exactly what he doesn't know. He'd never been to one to my knowledge. I think, Skip, also, I think the biggest thing is what I'm seeing and I could be wrong, Tom Brady is finally uh, enjoying the journey. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. For the first this 20 years, it was it. always the destination. Absolutely. But now, yes. man, the, the process, I got to enjoy this. Right. But if you could ever make a, make a case for waving the five-year rule yeah. and just putting somebody straight yeah. into the Hall of Fame the year after they retire? I believe they should do that. They do that in hockey. I know. Like Gretzky, well, like, retired, they put him in. Well, Messier well, retired, well, they put him in. Well, Tom Brady shouldn't have to wait five no. years, no. right? Just no. put him in. Yeah. Because Some guys, does yeah. anybody have any doubt yeah. about yeah. it? No, nobody yeah. has any doubt. So the point was that he enjoyed being there. But I think, to your original point, it backfired a little bit because I got to tell you, I was also shocked he got loudly booed. Yeah. <laughs> and I know some of it's like good nature because a lot of people are there to support Peyton. Right. So if, if you- Peyton fans go always boo Tom. They're gonna boo Tom. <laughs> and so it's funny, Peyton was going to make a joke about Tom and he said, my good friend Tom Brady. And he said it sarcastically because right. he's about to make a joke. Right. And then to Peyton's credit, he has enough comic timing that he just dead stopped and let everybody boo right. and then started up the joke again. Because you have to right. you have to wait. Right. You right. don't want to get right. drowned out right. or drowned out by the boo. Then, then people won't hear, won't hear the joke in the punchline. That is correct. <laughs> so in the end. I think it stung Brady a little bit that he got booed that loudly and he kind of turned around and acknowledged and, like, and fired What did I do wrong? Yeah, what did I do wrong? Nothing. <laughs> okay. It's nothing. Okay. Do I think it eats at Tom a little bit that Peyton was always a little more popular than Tom? More I think it does. I, yeah. Probably, it does. Yeah, yeah. And, and one big reason that I believe Peyton was more popular is that Peyton showed on Saturday Night Live, what, a couple times, two or three yes. times? That he's naturally funny, he is. right? He, he is. can do comic right. timing. Right. He can do skits. He can right. deliver jokes, right? Right. And the thing with Peyton, Skip, we know how meticulous he is. We know how much film he watches. It's hard yeah. for us to say anybody watched more film than Peyton Manning. But okay. he always found a way to lighten the mood. Yeah. It was like Tom was study, and it was just like always oh, just straight ahead. Correct. He, he wasn't funny. He had no, it was just like football, 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 win, win, win. And Peyton, like, you know what? I'm going to study, but I'm going to have some fun along this thing. You and did. so now people are getting an opportunity to see a different side of Tom. I, and I think I they're it. starting to like that side of Tom. Maybe a little bit, but they're still not ready to not well, boo him. Well, Skip, right? you, well, Skip we, if one year, you can't undo 20 years in one year. And, and Peyton, this is what we've seen from Peyton. This has been Peyton basically his whole career. We see him mic'd up and he's talking about, it. hey, did you make this Gatorade? This is some good stuff right here. You know, so we, we've heard bits and pieces. I don't I don't, know, I don't know if we've ever heard Tom mic'd up where it was exclusively. Yeah, he's mic'd up and he's like, yeah, and getting fired up and things of that nature. Yeah. But Peyton has always shown us a side of him that 
Tom has guarded, that have kept very close to the vest, but now... Because it was the Patriot way. Correct. Okay. But since he's been removed from that... Yep. He let his hair down. I, I say. And I like it. I like it. And I, and I told you, Skip, we talked about this before we went on break, is that I'm upset that it took 20 years and that he was up under Coach Belichick and the way they did business that we didn't get an opportunity to see yep. Tom Brady. For, I because totally I believe, agree. Because everybody talks about, man, Tom's a funny guy. He liked to play. You know, he likes yeah. to have a good time. Yeah. But we never saw that. We never saw now it. Now we're starting to so see. So what was Peyton's, the, the object of his shot? It was about Instagram because Brady is taking over Instagram. <laughs> yes. I mean, he's almost LeBron-esque on Instagram, yes, yes. and Peyton is not an Instagram kind of guy. Uh, Peyton don't even have Instagram. Okay, there we go. I don't think go. Peyton have any social media. There we go. So I do congratulate Peyton on because it was a great moment for yeah. him and his father and yeah. Eli and his mother and the whole family. It was great. Yeah, Way it, to it go. was unbelievable. But, I, but I'm not, Skip, I'm not surprised that Brady showed up. Man, I, I, I You know what? I'm surprised. I don't know. I don't know. Was Coach Belichick there? I would, I would not. I would not. Have been surprised if Coach Belichick had shown up. Mm. Hmm. It's gonna be interesting to see Coach Belichick show up at Tommy's. <laughs> I'm just not sure. Man, that's go ahead, stop, Skip. You know good where that He's man coming. You gotta be there. You gotta go. You will not be introducing him. <laughs> Maybe not. That's probably his dad. I if, hope if, so. If, if, if I'm there. thinking.